My name is Lee Borden. I'm the Area Management Biologist for Department of Fish and Game, Division of Sport Fish for Bristol Bay. We're out on Lake Aleknagik on a beautiful rainy day in Bristol Bay. Lake Aleknagik is close to Dillingham. It's easily accessible from town. It is one of the most popular places for people that visit Bristol Bay to come and fish. Lake Aleknagik is the first in a chain of five lakes. They call them the Wood River Lake System. It is the lowest lake closest to Bristol Bay and Wood River drains Lake Aleknagik into Bristol Bay. There's very, very good fishing for pike, arctic char, and rainbow trout to be had out on the lake. There's also pretty good fishing for silver salmon as well later in the fall. Char can be found at pretty much any stream mouth at the lake. Um, they can be caught using jigs, spinners, spoons, and sometimes flies. Uh, they're easiest to catch in the spring when the smolt out migration is taking place, or in the fall just post salmon spawn. The best way to fish for them, generally speaking, is to get at the drop off where the inlet stream oh, is dropping into the deeper part of the lake, and then jigging or using spinners uh, are pretty productive. Oh my gosh, my first pike! <laughs> pike are native to Lake Aleknagik. They're part of the natural ecology. Pike can be found in Lake Aleknagik along any weedy shoreline. Um, they tend to be found farther back on the lake, away from the boat ramp. They can be caught on pretty much anything shiny, anything flashy. Spinners work great. They can get pretty good size out here, and they naturally coexist with the rainbow trout all the five salmon species, and Dolly Varden and Archichar. So the weather in Bristol Bay is often rainy, as you can see. Generally, coming to Bristol Bay, you should plan for rain, but we do have quite a few sunny days out here if you get lucky. So another thing to be cautious about with Lake Aleknagik is the weather can turn pretty quickly. It's a very large lake, and if you're at the backside of the lake, the weather can turn on you and end up having you stuck on the back of the lake. So it's very important to pay attention to the weather, check forecasts before you come out, Make sure to wear life jackets and practice good boating safety.